welcome to Easy Eatery. My name is Angela and today is Throwback Thursday and we are going to make the classic beans and franks and we're gonna do it in the air fryer. Let's go put it together. All you need is some hot dogs, some pork and beans, remember those? Been a while, huh? Ketchup, mustard, and some brown sugar. Start off by putting our hot dogs in the air fryer. So we're gonna put those in at 350 degrees for about five minutes. Now that those are all cooked up, we're just going to go ahead and take those, um, lay those out all kind of like lined up and we're just going to go ahead and chop those into little bite-sized pieces. Alright, let's just go ahead and grab everything, all those little hot dogs and stick those in our air fryer safe bowl. Got this little bowl from QVC. I have so much fun playing with my accessories as you've noticed. <laughs> and um, go ahead and dump our uh, can of pork and beans in there. Oh my gosh, you guys, they smell so good. I forgot the smell of them. It has been seriously a long time since I've had these. So I was just going to go ahead and um, mix those up a little bit. Grab a about a good tablespoon of some ketchup, a little tiny drop of some Dijon mustard, and grab a couple, I'd say about two tablespoons of brown sugar and just kind of mix that all together. When I was growing up, we used to have this all the time. It is so delicious, kind of like a treat to us. And not only was it a treat to us, but it's also cost effective. So can't beat that, right? Win-win. And I'm glad that I was able to consult with my mom to get the recipe correct. All right, let's go put those back in the air fryer and we're gonna go ahead and put those in at 350 degrees for 10 minutes. And we are gonna mix those up in between just to make sure that they're all mixing properly together. And voila, 10 minutes later, look at there you guys. Let's just give those a quick little stir just to make sure that the, everything is all nice and done all the way through. Of course, I'm gonna have to take a bite because I have to make sure that this is exactly how I remember them to be. And um, I have to say, you guys, this is bringing back such memories. I am so loving these throwback Thursdays. Yep, tastes just like I remember. You can kind of get that little bit of um, mustard in there. And um, oh, it's just sweet, delicious, and good. I'm telling you, I don't know why we stopped making these. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And please give the video a thumbs up. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye now.